Nice, rise all the way back up. Again, grab a hold of that left wrist, reach over to the right. Come back up through center, flip that grip, exhale, other side. Come back up through center, exhale, forward fold, reach for those toes. Nice. So relax the hips, bend the knees as much as you need to. Let that head be heavy. And then use the strength of the inner thighs and the glutes and the core to rise all the way back up. Let's bring those hands to the hips. Let's start marching. Here we go, left, right, lift, lift. Again, we're just working to relax those hips. We wanna make sure we're not hiking up to the side. Right, we're relaxing those hips and lifting those legs up. Let's bring those hands to prayer, wishing position in front of the chest. We're gonna step out to the side so it's an open hip, even more open. Again, we're trying not to hike up, we're just letting that hip flexor do what it can right now. Bring those legs back together. Let's lift up onto the ball mounts of the toes and drop those heels. Ready? We lift up and down and up and down. Every time you lift, try to focus on that inseam up and down that leg. Take it up and hold. Drop that left heel down. Right knee will bend. And then switch. Ready? Double time. Switch. Switch. Switch, good work. We can tone the arms by pushing that right hand into the left and the left hand right into the right. Okay, now let's march it out, keeping those hands just where they are. We're gonna add a twist to this. We will start by twisting to the left first. Three, two, get ready, twisting left and right, left and right. So there's a little pause in center with those hands so that we can rotate above those hips. Go side to side. Just checking you all out. Nice. Back to center and we squat and lift. So feet are just about sit bone distance apart. We're bending and extending those legs. Let's take it down and hold. And ready, pull, pull, pull. You should be able to see your toes. You should be toning that chest. Hold it down, ready, lift that right heel and drop, just the right. Let's add the arms, back and forward. Showing you from the front, we're gonna add on. Ready, we take it down, up and around. Down, up and around. Work those shoulders. Three, two, get ready to reverse it. Ready, and go fast, and four, fast. We're still lifting that heel. Every time the arms come around, we're there for three, two, one, both heels down, straighten those legs. Let's march it up, 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 up. Ready, feel the butt. Tone that chest, work those hands right there. We've got it, five, four, three, two, one. Back to that chair pose. Opposite heel, lifts up and down. Maybe we sink a little deeper. Draw those drawstrings in. Corset tight. For four, four. Three more. Get ready to add the arm. It's two. One. We add the arm. Swim it back. Go lift as we swim. We lift it up. For three. It's two. That's good. We're ready to reverse. Here we go. Other way. So if you were doing the backstroke, you're now doing the breaststroke or the fly and vice versa. 
Woo! For four. Three more. It's two. And one. March it out. Let's swing those arms. Woo! Can you guys hear the music? Okay, a little bit. We're gonna step it out and in. Go into the right. It's out, out, in, in. Lateral, in. Hip abduction and adduction. Stay through center, hold. We're gonna go the other way. So warming up that lateral flexion. Ready? Three, two to the left. Out, out, in, in. Maybe you're getting a little lower. Trust me, warming up this hip is so good. Especially for what we're gonna do at the end of class today. Okay, let's kick those heels again to the butt. Warm up those hamstrings, so relax them here. Don't let them be tight. Shake out those hands. Now opposite hand to the heel. We tap it in, whoop, in. Doesn't matter where you are. Maybe get a little lower. Okay, that arm is gonna come across the front. Legs are gonna be the same. Opposite arm, opposite foot. So it's gonna look like we lift that leg and across. Get a little rotation. Ready, arm comes up to this side. Opposite arm, opposite leg. Doesn't matter really. Whatever feels right for you. Okay, back through center, march it out. Hopefully that heart rate is up a little bit. And the heart rate's a little lifted. Hit it, burn a little bit more. Little stretch here, bring the feet wider than the hips. Take those arms out like you're a star. Take that left hand to the right foot. Come back up, other side. Come back up, turn the toes out, click those heels in. Let's bring those elbows into those hips. Lift the ribs in, head against that wall, take it up and down. Here we go, it's up. Squeeze to come up. Press into all four corners of those feet. Reach those knees towards those pinky toes. Up and down that wall behind you. Imagine your back is on a towel. You're sliding up against that wall. Get a little lower now. Low to explode. Hold it here, hands to chest. Squeeze the right hand into the left and vice versa. Roll the shoulders down the back. Couple times. And then reverse it. Think a little deeper. Right elbow, right thigh, and back. And left, and back. Sit a little deeper, here we go. Back through center, we turn right. Center, we turn left. Center, we turn right. Other side. And twist. And twist. Two more, we take it. Center, hold. Sink a little deeper. Draw those knees back, squeeze those glutes. Take it all the way up. Woo, all 10 toes forward, bow it in. Let the hips relax here, let the head be heavy. Forward fold. Slowly lift halfway up. Right hand to the hip. Left hand to the hip. Come all the way up. Let's reach for our weight. And if you don't have weights, soup can, bottle water, nothing, tiny little puppy. <laughs> Let's step side to side. Just holding those weights by the side.
trying to get that music for you. Pick that heel up. Stretching out those quads. Now start to bring those arms up, palms face up. Hold it at the top. Bring those legs parallel. Take those weights to the shoulders and back up. Overhead press. Let's add a releve so we come to the toes and down and toes and down. For four, three more. If two, hold up for one. Bend those knees. Bring those weights to the shoulders. Bring those weights all the way down. We're gonna lift them up through the front. Right arm, lower. Left arm, lower. Right, just showing you from that profile, left. Both arms, here we go, straight up through center. Three, two, hold up for one. Bring those weights to the chest. Drop those heels, turn out. First position, click those heels together if you can. Showing you a little bit on an angle. As you plie, those weights come out. We bring them up and out. Hold it here. You're in that turnout. Bring those arms out. Bend those arms. Ready for plie? Wait, come in front of us. As we releve, we open them back out. Double time. We take it down. Up. Woo! Heels down and first can be harder than releve. Because our ankles are constricted and our ankles are directly related to our hips. So our hips feel restricted here. For four, three, two, open for one. Bring those weights down. Turn those heels out. So we're in a little bit wider stance and sit bone distance apart. We're gonna bend those knees, opposite arm goes in front, turn, come up, twist and turn, up. Showing you from that side view. For four. One more each side. Great job, come through center, march it out, out, out. Let that, that bicep curl, flow. Again. One more. Hold it here, punch it up, we punch it up. Step that opposite foot out. Point the toe, contract the leg. Squeeze the glute. Woo! Get ready to make it a little harder. Take it out, out. Opposite leg is bending. Bring those weights to the chest. Double time. Point, point, squeeze, squeeze. Get a little height. Woo! Don't stop. Right here, we got it. Up, out, fix, fix. Watch your dogs, Amy. <laughs> All right, curtsy lunge. Take that right foot back. Pull. Step it up, left leg back. Pull, curtsy lunge. Try to keep those joints stacked. Side to side, we take it center. Curtsy. <laughs> Add a bicep curl. Bring it up. <laughs> so we curl at the center.
Three more. One more each side. Great, walk it out. Let's roll that shoulder up. And roll it forward. Other side. And forward. Let's step it wide. Turn out, second position. Bring those arms up overhead. Bend the elbow as you bend the knee. Bring those weights just behind the head. Squeeze those elbows to the temples. We take it up and down. <clears throat> Four. Three. Two. Take it up for one. Hold. Plie, bring those arms out to the side. Fifth position with the arm. We take it up. Down. Draw those ribs towards the hips as you come up. Four. Three. Two. One. Bring those weights down. Drop those knees again. Right forearm, right inner thigh. Left arm straight up. We take it side. Side bend, no back bend. If you feel this in the small of the back, drop the weight. Or make sure your back is right up against that wall. Think one inch deeper. Take it up and down. Or four. Three more. It's two. Take it up for one. All ten toes forward. Exhale. Bow it in. Weight come down. Keep your left hand on that weight. Right arm open. Switch it out. Other arm up. <laughs> Come back down. Take that right leg. Bring it behind that left leg. Think skaters here. And we switch, 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 switch. On and on. Don't stop, you got it. Eight seconds count. Two, one. Slowly rise back up with those weights. Legs together. Turn to the, I'm turning to the side. <laughs> Bend those knees. <laughs> Bring those weights to the hips. Squeeze those elbows in. Strong, straight back. Ready, bring him to the shoulders and back. Curve that lower back, like that tailbone under. Kind of the neck. Hold it back, slap those hands behind the back. In, in, in. Come right back up, stand up tall. Take it back. 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 One more. Stand up tall. Back and hold. Palm face up. Swim up. Up. Pulse it up. Woo! Four. Three. Two. One. Bring it all the way down. Slowly roll up without those weights. Take that right arm across the body. Let that right shoulder drop. Other side.
weights out of the way. Come into a high plank. If you have a mat, feel free to put it down. Top of a push-up, stacking those wrists. We're gonna tap those knees, shift forward, push up, come back up, high plank. So it's knees, down, up, lift, knees, lower, up, lift, take it down, five, lift, take it down, four, lift, take it down, three, you got it, take it down, two, one more, we take it down. High plank hold. Just hold it, you got it. Scoop the pit of the belly up and in, put that corset in. Scoop that tailbone, reach it towards your heels. Crown of the head reaches in opposition. Hold. Don't go anywhere, you got it. We're here to stay. 10 more seconds, you can do anything for 10 seconds. Drop those knees, child pose. Like, I forgot to tell. <laughs> Good work. Slowly rise up through hands and knees. Shift the hips back, downward dog. From downward dog, walk the hands back to meet the feet. Bend those knees, slowly roll up. Grab those weights again. Hopefully you have some space. We're gonna open, close, open, kick. Open, close, open, kick. Squat, kick. Hug a tree as you plie, kick, down, up, down. Kick, down, up, down, kick. You can do this without the weights, right? You do you. Down, up, down, kick. Getting a little lower, taking the leg a little higher. Without hiking up that hip, just lifting through that natural lateral flexion. Here we go. Two more. One more each side. Whew, it's hard even without those weights. Great, let's bring those weights down or just out of the way. Quick sip of water if you need it. Get your bar ready. I'm going to start with my left leg as a supporting leg, the one closest to the bar. I'll call it supporting leg and working leg. Doesn't have to be right or left. Start in parallel. Rock under the heels. Open up first position. Elevate onto the tips of the toes. Drop the heels. Down and up. Corset, drop string in. Tailbone reaching down every time you rise up. Four. Three more. Two. Take it up for one. Come to that plie. Draw those knees back, squeezing those glutes. Tuck that tailbone under. Up and down here. We take it up and down. Staying in that releve. If that's not working for you today, you drop those heels. Notice you can probably go deeper because we're not restricting the ankle so much here with that flat foot. Get ready. You hear it coming up. Hold it low. Knees draw in and out. We bring them in. Out. Touch. Open. Adduct. Abduct. Woo! Go a little deeper, maybe. Hold it back. Double tight. Back, back, back. Woo! 
Keep going. You got it. Back, back. Most about the back. Take it all the way up. Drop those heels. Side reach. Nice. Let's shake out the legs a little bit. Open wide, second position. Take a bronze plie. So in other words, as deep as you can go here, where you're not bringing that chest forward a whole lot. And then we're gonna turn and we're gonna come into a double lunge. And open back up. Ready, here we go. Lunge, plie, lunge, plie. You got it, lunge, plie. Looking good. Nice, I'm loving the peacock, Ashley. Oh, hi, Ray. I see you, Ray. Woo, good job, Ray. Four, three more. Two, one and hold. Hands to the chest, squeeze them in. Sink a little deeper, take it down an inch, up an inch. Woo. Down an inch, up an inch. Down an inch, up an inch. Take it down and hold. Pull, pull, pull. Drain those legs. Turn towards your bar. Working leg is going to lift. We're going to tap it down as we bend the supporting leg. And we lift and down. Lift and down. Don't overthink it. You don't have to come all the way down. We're working that supporting leg. If you want a little more, come on the toes, releve. Woo, four, four. Three more. It's two. Take it up for one. Kick that heel to bottom. In, in, in. Woo. My supported leg is slightly bent. I'm on the tips of the toes. You can drop that heel if you need to. Great job. Let it go. Supporting leg. Crosses over working leg. Figure four. Good, shake it out. Let's take that bar to the other side or go to the other side. Start in parallel, rock under those heels, open up first position. We lift up to the toes, push those arches out. Keeping the heels lifted, we slide down that wall. We drop the heels and straighten the leg. So once again, it's an elevate. Plie, heel, lift, up, down, three, four, lift, plie, three, four, lift, plie, three, four, keep going, lift, plie, three, four. Nice. Lift. Plie, three, four. Let's reverse it now. So now we plie with the heels flat, then lift those heels, take it all the way up, and drop those heels. Ready? So it's down, lift, up, drop. Plie, push, lift, down. One, two, three, four. Good. Three more. Left one. Right here. Step it wider. From here we take that plie. Shoulders draw back. Lift that outer heel. Drop it down. Lift the inner heel, wrap it down. Hands can come off the bar. Hands might be good on the hips. So you notice if you're hiking up on that hip, relax those hips. 
Work the strength of that quadricep, that calf, and that glute to lift that leg. Core is tight. Woo! Both heels ready. Lift. Lift. Three more. Woo, who's shaking? Two. <laughs> One. Straighten those legs. Shake it out. Come right back in. Heels are down. Draw those legs back and forward. Back. 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 Take it back. Sink deeper. Double time. It's back. 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 Woo, you got it. Here we go, a little deeper. Just that, out, 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 out. Last eight count, we've got it. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Woo, take it up, shake it out. <laughs> Come back to that second position. We take that lunge, plie, lunge. Plie, double time, and it's lunge. Plie. Keep going, good work. Make sure you turn the hips in the same direction as the toes. So turn all the way around. Even if that means you're going slower, you do you. Four more. Four. Three. Two. One into that plie. Straighten those legs. Bend them again. Straighten those legs. Bend them again. Straighten those legs, turn towards that bar. Bend that supporting leg. As you tap it down, it's up. Up. Up, kick your butt. I'm breaking a sweat. Now, come up onto the tips of the toes if you want to elevate your practice. You want to make it harder, just smile. That's freaking hard. Hold it up, heels and butt, let's get it. Get that heel to the butt, you can. You can bend that supporting leg. We're not done, keep going. Not stopping. Here we go, eight more, it's eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, woo! Shake it out. Supporting leg, crosses up and over, figure four, woo! Good job, Stanley. Aha. Keep going. Keep that stretch. Nice. Slowly come on up. Great work. Sip of water if you want. We're going to come onto the floor. We have less than a minute. Just a couple stretches side to side. Please take more stretching when we're done. So if you have a mat, you can use it. You're gonna sit in a stag or pretzel-like position, mermaid, whatever you wanna call it. Arms are gonna come in front of you. You're gonna lift up on that shin and the back shin. Not good for your knees, don't go there. Come back down, take a side stretch, lift the side hip. So it's down, front, down, side. Woo! I think we have less than a minute. So if we get cut off, please make sure you do both sides. <laughs> I'm seeing lots of puppies. <laughs> All right, let's hold it here. Nice big stretch up and over. Drop the hips, take it to the side. Come on down to that side.
Stay there on that side. Again, in case we get cut off, same thing, other side. Take a forward fold. If you have time, maybe a quick little back bend before that forward fold. Let's switch those legs. You guys were awesome. You made my day. Like I said, <laughs> was it your fault? <laughs> but just your problem. <laughs> just kidding. You guys are never a problem. And it's lift. Squeezing those glutes, lifting that hip. 